Hey there, friends, and welcome back to another episode of God of War. It's an awesome game, and I hope you're enjoying it, so take a second before we begin to hit that like button, and we'll get onto that gameplay video. Enjoy! Okay, moving on. What do we need to do next? We need to get a boat, and we need to... Because we have the chisel, so we need the rune. So what does this say about getting the rune? Goals. Go to Tears Vault. <clears throat> Tears Vault is here? No. No. Where the heck is Tears Vault? This one has like this like yellow circle around it. Is that because that's hidden chamber of Odin? Part of the mountain shop. Mystic gateway. Is the journey. So that's where we need to go. It's only 43 meters away. It's right here then, right? Tears Vault is at the bottom of those stairs. Just take them all the way to the bottom. Well, if I had only taken four more steps forward, he would have told me what I needed to hear. Of course. Ooh, Tears Vault is behind that magical lock. Brother, that one? Do I need to get in the boat? No, it's right here. Got it. Okay. I just wasn't looking the correct direction. Of course I wasn't. Oops, I pressed the wrong button. Trying again. And there and there. All right, sweet. Wow, I can't believe we're setting foot in Tears Vault. Another one of these. Another one of these, indeed. Look at all these runes. There's something over there. There's something over there. It's oh, yes. Tears, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tyr was a god, not a giant. Ah, but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Okay. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. That's so cute. What if you need to use one and I'm not there? This will be fun. Andreas. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. <clears throat> okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry. Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. It smells like... Rain? Oh! oh no! Oh no! I ruined everything! I earned that fucking hammer! But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Cause Magni's gone! Won't be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me. You 
dumb. That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! true but I'm gonna get to know you really well you're gonna be my new brother right after I finish killing your father that is a really creepy thing to say what whoops was that Mostly God broke him. <laughs> oh my god yeah Kratos is not gonna stand for that no Back. Oh, yeah. No. This isn't over. Brother, the boy. God. Atreus. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. I'm so curious. What is going on? It looked like... Wait, what happened? Everything changed. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. It looked like Atreus was about to have Spartan rage. Like he did the same thing Kratos does when he initiates Spartan Rage. So I'm just like, what happened? Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Freya's forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's hard. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in a god. But a god believing himself immortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Do it. Was that something I was just supposed to assume? That because Kratos is a god, Atreus is naturally a god as his son? But that would have to mean that the mom was a god. Otherwise, Atreus would be a demigod, right? Or was that some sort of big reveal? And uh, my brain is just confused. <laughs> I don't know what to think now. Because <laughs> they haven't told us anything about him. All they've said is he's sick. And now they're saying he has some mental thing going on. And I'm like, what's the mental conflict? What's his conflict? What's Atreus's conflict that's so deep that his sickness has been around since he was young? I have so many questions and I just want answers. Somebody just called the serpent. Somebody? Who? Who can talk to the serpent but us? We have Mimir. He said no one else speaks it anymore. All the questions! 
Well, if they kill the world serpent, that's going to be sad. He was our friend. The fever burns hotter. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Well, I can't go any faster. because they want us to feel the tension, isn't it? I feel Maria! it. Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! He's ill. Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Mm. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding hold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your Frost Axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not under any circumstances cross the bridge of the damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Well, you know what's hey, gonna happen then. You must hurry. Because that's how foreshadowing works. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the bridge keeper's heart. And your son may survive. No. Rhea. When last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Where's her baby? If she's a mother, where's Freya's child? I have so many questions. I want them all answered. Also, where are we going? How are we going to get there? Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. This is a nice leafy boat. Sad to think that our frost axe will be useless after we've spent this whole game like powering it up. Ooh. It's so ominous. That's interesting. Athena. Get out of my head.
<laughs> Seems to be one of those recurring themes fighting his past demons. I wonder what the glowing head deer, the glowing antler deer is representing. Mother, maybe? Doesn't seem right, though. I don't know. I can definitely feel the tension of this moment. And I do wonder why the world has changed now that Atreus has fallen ill. Like I know it could be Modi's anger slash Odin's anger, but I'm also just super interested in doing any good at all? What's up with that? Is it because... What? It's not doing any good at all. Okay. Alright. How do I put that away? I don't remember how to put it away. Here, I'll just throw it. Alright. ground so I couldn't kick him. just have both of them in front of me. Wow, my reactions are lame today. I can't parry to save my life. that oh yeah let's get these for sure because i have a feeling the stranger is gonna come a calling sometime soon after Is this that classic God of War weapon? It 
Seems like it. I'm actually really excited about this. This is so epic. Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. Oh. <laughs> you cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. Oh, shit! Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Yeah, I wish I knew. Oh my gosh. So cool. Ah, it's so cool! Oh my gosh. As my first God of War game, it is really exciting to me that I get to use this weapon because it's always looked so cool and I've never gotten to like actually use it. So this is really exciting. Oh, it's so satisfying. It's so cool. There's a parry. Oh, this music is so epic, too. Oh, man. So kind of crazy that Kratos is not a father. Kind of crazy because he must not be Atreus's father. In which case, who is and who is his mother? Kinda makes you ask all those questions. Quite well in Helheim. Now I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there, in your own front yard, no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Return to the realm travel room. He just said in your own backyard. There we go. Here we go. All right. This story just got a lot more depth, which is very exciting. Okay, back to Brock shop. Through the magical door. Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? I can assure you I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Liar. Don't well, tell me anything about anyone, because your head is on my record, butt. I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway.
I still don't really know how this circular realm travel thing works. Because it's circular. This is obviously where I entered. I've made a complete circle. <laughs> Just looking for that door. But I also, you can't, when you, when you enter, you can't also walk the other way and get there. Because I think it's a sneaky loading screen. And I think, uh... They, they have all this dialogue that they want you to go through while you're walking through. So I think you have to walk the full circle. What? Hey! You reek of foreign magic! Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? I've never seen the like. That's gotta be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son. My brother and me created Mjolnir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them... Them special. Hey, where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Now, we all got to take responsibility sometime, huh? Say, what can I do to help? I can do things. We what, can I should do tag things. Along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. I'll be keeping my eye on you. You can upgrade my blades? Don't worry, kids are tough. When I was his age, I cut my own head clean off. And I'm none the worse for wear. Huh. Alright then. To Helheim! I love this room. Literally, if I could build a room that was like my chill space, it would look like this. Have like one big tree in the middle, like glowing, providing shade for the weird sunlight that still wafts through even though you're indoors. Be all purpley and blue. Little floating things floating around. Yeah. Mythological filigree everywhere. Now that Freya's given you the travel room to Helheim, it should be unlocked on the table. There we go. Let's do it. This is done. We really are doing this. What are we gonna find there? I'm so curious. the gate, as we like to say. I'll be watching your back.
Why does it look the same? Let me take this moment to tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Not even Odin can survive this cold. So, I hope those blades work. That's so interesting that Nordic mythology hell is freezing. It's not hot. It's not fiery. It's freezing. This is my hell. Maybe I'm Nordic. <laughs> oh, hello. Family heirloom. Break. Break again. It's fine. Let me just smash all these vases and then we can move on. As you know, I started my gaming adventure with uh, Uncharted, and all we do is smash priceless vases before we can move on. So, just it's really fitting. Is this the bridge Freya spoke of? No, we're still on the realm travel bridge. We're after the Bridge of the Damned. The dead use it to cross into their permanent home, the city of Helheim. The bridge keeper who minds admission, he's the one we want. Just follow this bridge. Should lead us straight to him. You know, I really hope never to see this place again. Well, this weapon seems to be working fine on them, so... Frost your to burn away that hell's bramble blocking the path. Okay, but first, a take. Spartan Charge, Light Runic Attack, a dash attack that slams enemies with a fiery shield and inflicts a small amount of burn damage. I like this fire and ice thing. I like it a lot. Cool. So now we, this is a runic attack for our blades, which is different than if we had our ax. So, this is our very first runic attack for our blades. That's very exciting. So we'll go ahead and upgrade that right away. Ooh, we can't upgrade it a second time, but we will equip it. Sweet, and we don't have anything for that. And we have wooden blade grips. Okay, had I known that I was gonna be needing runic attacks and different pommels, I would have went to Brock. I still could. I'ma do it. Brock has something, right? I couldn't upgrade it because I didn't have the Chaos Fire, but he has a pommel I could use. I suspect. So we're gonna go find out. Uh, I need your help, sir. Say hi to the Pimple Flap for me when he's better. Pimple Flap! Never in my life did I imagine those two things, those two words would be used together as an insult to a young boy. <laughs> Who wrote that dialogue? Who wrote that line? Who was in some sort of writer's room at a round table saying, okay, what are some punchy words Brock could use <laughs> against Atreus? <laughs> Pimple flap. Nonsense. I love it though. So we can't upgrade our blades, which is kind of a bummer, but it also kind of makes sense. Like I get it. So we can use our blades on these Twigs. Basically twigs. Oh, more? Okay. Alright, perfect. Many reasons we went back for those blades. What are those? Oh, 
Well, I ah! How dare you attack from behind? Anybody else want a piece of this? No? Well, that makes sense. Okay. Wow, there's just so much ice everywhere. It's like this is the coldest place in all the realms or something. Smash! Oh, yeah. what I wanted. Ah! I'm practicing my parries. Oh, that was red! Oh, I should have known! It was red! I don't like these guys! Don't you jump on me! I've got a son to save. This is all wrong. Only the newly dead should be here. There's too many. The gate must be closed, and if the gate's closed, then it's true. Hell's full up. Without the Valkyrie to sort and cull them, hell is overwhelmed. So killing the Valkyries causes chaos down here? Hmm. Oh, wait. The Valkyrie spirit was freed from her body, so... We did a good thing by the Valkyries? I don't know. It's kind of hard for me to figure that one out. It might be sort of complicated. What is that? Whatever it is, I see I've seen them a few times now and I want to destroy them. Huh. I have to come back for you then. Yeah, like this. Maybe it's for something, maybe it's not. I don't know. Are you just gonna... Okay. You, you just hang out there then. Yep. Yep, just smash all that. Mm-hmm. Good stuff, good stuff. Smash these faces for sure. Yep, mm-hmm. Ooh, man, this is... This is yikes. This is real dark. See, like, what to do with you? I imagine I'll get another chance at it, but I feel like... What? Now what? Through the side gate! feel weird without Atreus, like, adventuring without him feels so wrong. Maybe that's the point, right? Alright, these ones have shields. Not really sure what that's about. But they're gonna let me smash this chest open, so... SMASH IT! Excellent. I've smashed it. Now, take them on. And that right there is going to be the end of today's episode. That was a fun one. What did you think? Please leave me a comment and let me know. And of course, don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. All that good stuff. I love you guys so much. Bye!